Welcome to ABCD. We're going to do some nerve blocks of the limbs. The ulnar nerve block at the wrist is a nice block. Um, the landmark technique is to find the flexi carpi ulnaris at the level of the ulnar styloid. Have your patient hyperextend their wrist. So there'll be the flexor carpi ulnaris tendon. Under that is the ulnar artery and ulnar to that is the ulnar nerve at the proximal wrist crease so tendon artery nerve styloid tendon artery nerve styloid to prep the skin we're just going to go directly in and you need to go in about half a centimeter so um, five millimeters in and uh, then you're in the right spot and essentially then hold the needle and infiltrate the local anesthetic and this will be um, about three to five mils of local anaesthetic. Put in an extra three mils subcutaneously just to block the dorsal branches to the hypothenar area. So the ulnar nerve block at the wrist. Extend the patient's wrist, palpate the flexicarpi ulnaris, ulnar to this is the ulnar artery, and ulnar to that is the ulnar nerve. Go in a depth of five millimetres with a volume of about three to five mils and add three mils subcutaneously to block the dorsal branches. You can use the ultrasound to find the ulnar nerve and the best place to pick up the ulnar nerve is about 5 to 10 centimetres proximal to the wrist crease. The structures is the flexor carpi ulnaris tendon and then as you move more ulna, the ulnar artery and then lastly the ulnar nerve. So we've got the tendon which is out here and you can probably flex and I'll be able to see something. And then we've got the artery, and then immediately ulnar to that is the nerve. Tendon, artery, nerve, styloid. So just translocate your probe so that you can see the nerve, um, and then you're going to come in at an angle so you can still see the needle. You can't go in directly down because you won't be able to see it. It's going to come in like that, and you're going to come in, um, and you're just going to. Um, see it, and you'll, uh, once you're in position, you can infiltrate your local anesthetic. So, the ulnar nerve block with ultrasound, pick up the nerve 5 to 10 centimetres proximal to the wrist crease, follow the nerve down to the proximal wrist crease, confirm the position of the ulnar nerve, which will be ulnar to the ulnar artery. Translocate the probe so the needle and nerve can be seen in the same field of vision. Enter your needle at an angle, and then infiltrate with a volume of 3 to 5 mils around the nerve.